Ah, well guys, you know what they say. All good things must come to an end. But, I really don't want it to come to an end, honestly. I really don't. <laughs> I love this game so much. This definitely was one of my favorite Assassin's Creed games of all time. I mean, granted it was really short, which kind of sucks. I, I wish it was a little bit longer, but either way, for what it was, it was amazing. So, I just absolutely loved this game so that being said welcome to the finale everyone of assassin's creed mirage thank you so much for all the love and support you guys really and truly mean a lot to me and yeah i don't know where this channel would be without you guys so thank you so much and with that being said everyone it's time to end this once and for all you know what's crazy? I did not even realize that there wasn't going to be any present day story in this. Which, you know, I'm, I'm always hooked on like the present day story. Because that's usually what I go for. But... What do you see? Hey, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. Alright, there's one. Got three different ways this time. Really? Okay. We got people at the front door. All right, so three different ways. So we got this. It seems Ali decided to attack the palace after all. His rebels could distract these guards. Hmm. Can I possibly get on the other side? Like over here, maybe? Let me see some real quick. If I go this way, will I be able to get on this wall over here and just get over... Wait, hold on. I think this might work. Hang on. Gardens of power. Oh my gosh. I'm over. Let's go. Success. I must be quick and quiet. Abiha will be on her guard. Of course she will. Ooh, take it easy. What? Get down here. Hiya! Okay, so how do I... Aha! Oh, of course I'm out of ammo. Gosh, dang it. Can I please retrieve the knife from this guy's body? Let's go. We're about to... Fr we're, we're about to... Here we go. We're about to make some business happen. Go get him, guys. Oh, I thought they were going to barge in. I guess not. Well, in that case, I guess I'll just... Wait a minute. Someone's coming. Oh, I can't reach him. Shoot. All right, whatever. I'll just get these three. Boom. 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 Initiate. Chaos be my Come on in, fellas. Come on in. There we go. That'll distract him. Hopefully this distracts them as well. Look at him go. I mean, there's not many guards here. I'm just going to do this him and get him initiate time to battle come on bring it on oh really get off come on I want to do something oh dang it oh really come on oh shoot the mouth on you Okay. 
Hold on. Ooh. Hold on, I want to do something. Come on. Gosh dang it. Come on. Well, never mind then. Didn't get the chance, man. I didn't get the chance. Hopefully we're fighting more enemies, though. Hopefully it's not all over. Door barred. Okay. Have to find another way in, I guess. Let's go ahead and fight this dude. What's up, man? Boom! Alright, it's like right up here. Oh no, did the game... <gasps> the game crashed! Are you kidding me? Really? The game actually crashed, I love it. We haven't had too many of those at all. Throughout this series. And of course it crashes right on the finale, I love it. I love it. I really don't understand why it crashed, because, like, it doesn't quite make sense of why it, it crashed. There's nothing really going on. Man, am I going to have to redo all of that? I'm guessing so. This thing's so cool to look at. Woo, baby. So sick. I love that. Man, that's so sick. I love that so much. <laughs> I could watch that like 10 times more and I'd still be thoroughly entertained. <laughs> All right, we're back. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm guessing we're, we're, we're probably going to have to redo all that, which, whatever. It is what it is. I kind of want to go back to Basim's Valhalla outfit. That's just such a goaded outfit. I do love, like, the white and red. But, man, there's just something about Basim's Valhalla outfit that's just... It's so good. It seems Ali decided to attack the palace after all. His rebels could distract Yep, I'm right here. Alright. Let's go back to the Valhalla costume. Can't be beat, man. It can't be beat. And it's still, like, red and white, so, you know. Kind of still works out. Alright, let's try this again. I'll probably get, like... A chance to do what I want to do in combat because I've been wanting to do it for a while and I never got the chance so here we go I must be quick and quiet Abiha will be on her guard oh my goodness oh crap I can't do anything come on then oh there we go kick him I love it Love it. Here we go, here we go. Alright. Let's get the knives ready. One. And two. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. Initiate. Peekaboo. I see you. <sighs> Open the gates. Be my friend, mask my steps. Wait, just a... Let's go, everybody. Fight to the death. You guys deal with that. I'll deal with these guys. Might as well, right? Gives me two. At least. 
Oh man, I keep pressing B. I wanted to dodge towards him. There we go. Oh! Wait, hold on, hold on. Okay, easy. Back off. Ooh. Got him. You die now. Time to play. Well done, guys. Well done. All right, that's barred. So let's try this again. Let's pick up our friend over here first. Oh, he's up. Never mind. All right, hopefully the game doesn't crash again. That would be nuts. There we go. Yeah, buddy. Oh, he's in there. Okay. Interesting. What? Shut your face. All right, how? I mean, I guess we're gonna have to kill him, right? Come on. Nice try. Alright, cool. Let's talk to this guy now. Go where they will. This man, such heaviness in the air today. These are treacherous times. And most inhospitable. Are we not bade to honor the guest as he is entitled? We are. But Al Mutawakkil was murdered in his winter palace. Security has increased here since. I can see that. Everywhere I go, I am met with dark looks and locked doors. Hmm. Dang it. I don't have it. Thank you for listening, Sayidi. Servants go where they will. This man might help me open some doors. I need a token, man. Hi there. <laughs> Goodbye. Time to vanish. So I need to bribe him or whatever with the token. Don't really know how I can get that, because I don't have any more tokens. So I'm not really sure... Door's locked, gotta find the key. Question is, who has the key? What the? Hey! Gotcha! <laughs> Who has the key, I wonder? Come on. Nice try, buddy. You wanna try again? Woo! Oh, come on. Woo, baby. All right, let's see if I can get in here. Can I get in this way? Nope. Barred from here, too, huh? Interesting. Ah, here we go. Found a way in. Finally. Finally. <laughs> now to find Kobiha. And save Alamut. All right, Kabiha, where are you at? I will take this. Hmm. 
If I was Kabiha, where would I be? Probably underground, right? Somewhere underground, maybe? Man, everything's locked. I found a kit. Okay, I got the key. Don't know to exactly what. Ali's rebels are at the gate. You really didn't hear that? I'll take it. Oh! So that unlocks that. Okay, cool. Here we go. We got something over here. Wait, wait, what was this over here, though? Oh, it's just a chest, okay. Hello there. What was it Arib recited? Another one? Read many volumes by Arib. Kobiha is an admirer. Blue, black, white, and yellow tone. Which book would Kobiha choose to mark her path? She had Arib's book in her office. Uh. What was it Arib recited? Rage as the ocean, I'll sweeten your storms. Scorch as the desert, I'll bathe in your heat. Strike as the cobra, but plunge in my breast. Soar as the dove, but alight in my nest. Hmm. Uh, probably this one would be white, if I had to guess. Blue, black, white, and yellow tomes. All right, let's recite again. What was it Arib recited? Rage as the ocean, I'll sweeten your storms. Scorch as the desert, I'll bathe in your heat. Strike as the cobra but plunge in my breast, sore as the dove, but alight in my nest. Okay, so cobra. Would that be, would the cobra be black, maybe? I wanna say the cobra is black. Obviously the first one's blue because of the ocean. <clears throat> there we go. <clears throat> Very nice. And then I'm really hoping this is the final color. If not, I'll probably switch yellow and black. That it? I must have missed something. Yeah, okay. Let me switch uh, the two books here. Wait, did I take it? Oh, place book, yep. All right, so this one's yellow because of the cobra, I guess. So this one's yellow. All right, and this one is black. Please work. The ocean is blue, the desert gold. The ocean is blue, the desert gold. I, did I do it? I guess I didn't. Um, hold on. What was it, Arib? Scorch as the desert, I'll bathe in your heat. Scorch in the desert, I'll bathe in your heat. That's the second one is yellow. Second one is yellow. Desert's yellow. Which means this one might be white then. And then this one's the black one. So this one is the black. There we go. 
And then this one is probably the white. Right? Come on. Anything? Did I do it? He didn't say anything. I'm going here real quick. Secret chamber. I mean, I thought I found it. I thought that was it. Hmm. I know I got blue right. Alright. Unless it's the wrong way around. So it's blue, yellow, black, white. So it's blue here. This is blue. Let me go get the blue. It's my top speed, man. <laughs> Never thought I'd see a puzzle in this game. At the very end of the game, I love it. So blue, yellow, black, white. Blue. There we go. Next one is yellow. Black, because a plunge at the heart, which causes death, so that would be black. And the last one should be white. If this doesn't work, I don't I don't know what to do. I might have to look it up, I don't know. Please work. Please. Let's go, baby! Woo! Man. I wonder who. I called it, man. Underground. I called it. Classic. All right. Hi there. Where are you going? Get back here. Come here. Oh, you little. So many years spent searching. Combing ancient tomes and tombs. Tracing forgotten histories. Snatching at rumor and at myth. When all I needed to do was wait. For you. To come to me. Prodigal Sion has arrived. Yet he knows not what he is. <laughs> Have you not wondered at your nature? You, who see more, who know more. <laughs> Ooh. Even my son knew to ask what you were. When he saw your hand touch and wake the ancient's gift. What am I? Something more than man. Enough riddles. Speak plainly. Why speak what can be shown? Come with me to Alamut. Beneath its temple walls lies all the knowledge that you are heir to. Your so-called brothers would sooner die than see you claim it. But take heart, Basim. 
We will prepare the way. And set you free. Ah, no! No way. What poison have you lapped at her lips? She said I was something more than man. What did she mean, Roshan? What lies beneath the temple? That is forbidden ground. There's nothing there for you. I told you of the nightmares. The jinni. You called it weakness. Told me to mend it. I tried and tried, but you hid the way. You let me struggle alone! Not alone! You are not the first to walk the shadows broken, Basim. Stitch your shattered pieces into a hole. Pour your pain into the Brotherhood. Hurt yourself of the poison she dripped and come home to us. No more than a man, but no less than our brother. Or is it too little for you? What if it is? Follow the path she laid out for you, and I will kill you myself. Dang! What is she hiding? Okay, Roshan. I have to get out of here. Well, that's I the have end of to her. Me hell what I have learned. Guard! Guard! To me! Gosh dang, you're fast, buddy. Oh, oh my, my goodness. goodness. Okay, okay. Where's the way out? I don't know the way out. Go towards the lights! Run towards the lights! Woo! Oh my goodness. Okay, going this way. Coming through! Oh yeah, I have a... Uh, smoke bombs. Guess I should use that, huh? Go ahead and use one, I guess. Alhamdulillah. Again, I have escaped with my life. And left things broken behind me. Whew. Okay, I didn't think that was uh, gonna end that way. So now we need to return back home. The last journey. Oh, man. She's done. Wow. And now we're back with our old friends. How about that, huh? Now that, I was not expecting. Whew, but thank God for fast travel, am I right? So shoot, man, what are we gonna do? Are we... Like, are we gonna... The earth has shifted beneath my feet. I need to get back to firmer ground. I need home. I need me home. So what are we gonna do, man? Are we gonna kill Roshan? That would be crazy. That would be such a crazy ending. Us killing, like, our mentor. We're about to find out, man. Here we go. Really? Come on. Leave me alone. Come on, bro. Leave me alone. There they are. Kind of hard to see. You can't really. You're with me. All right, spread out. Don't come in here. Find the dog. Oh, okay, well. Wait, what? Oh, freaking heck, man! Come on. Yo, you just hit a civilian. 
Oh my goodness. All right, you know what, guys? Let's go. Let's go to where it all began, huh? Get off. Who's next? Okay. I have heard it all before. Yeah, nice try. You want to try it? Come on, try it. Nice try. Oh. Get off. All right, where's your friend at? There you are, there you are. Woo. Ow. Wait, why don't I just do this? Wait. There we go. That works. Come on. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Ow. Jerk face, man. Come on. What? You did not even, like, land that. Okay. All right, buddy. No! Oh! Fight smarter. Really? Okay. Okay, this guy's annoying. Be better. Ow! I'm gonna die. This this guy's literally gonna kill me. You jerk! Oh my god. Yep, I'm dead. Freaking heck, man. I was trying to like roll like over him and everything, but it just didn't work for some odd reason, so I don't know. It was very odd. But obviously I wasn't gonna win that fight. <laughs> Okay, I'm really close to home now. Please don't be any guards, please. Oh, thank God. All right. Basim, are you well? Basim. I... I do not know. You... You were right, Niha. My enemy, Kabiha. She held the answers. What did you learn? That there is more to who I am. A truth Qabiha tried to tell me. A truth my master sought to silence. That truth lies at Alamut. So we ride for Alamut. Yeah, I guess. Oh shoot, here we go. I will go, Nihal. I alone. You need me. I need you safe. I am safe with you, and you with me. I may find nothing there but danger and death. This is my fate. I will not turn back from it, but neither will I have you face it. Where you go, there I will go. Where you rest, there I will rest. I will walk behind you every step of the way. You are never alone. Now get packing. We will not leave Alamut until you have found the answers you seek. Oh, man. So long, home. Yeah, that's a nice little mask. A baklava. Love how she's not wearing anything. Oh, no 
way. Oh my gosh. Masia. Are you kidding me? No. Who's that? Oh my gosh, I'm so happy right now. That's not good. Noor? Not the welcome you were expecting, oh. eh? Oh! Well, at least you had the fortune to be elsewhere when the Tahirids came for us. What happened? I, uh... Fear Alamut has fallen. I was tasked with finding help. I went into the desert to find other patrols. Then I found you. Were there... others... with me? No. Only you. Then Nihal lives. And Roshan? I had hoped she would be with you. Come, brother. We must head out. Find any survivors and cleanse Alamut of its infestation. I, uh... fear I cannot. How bad? I will make every last one of them pay. Vengeance is not our way, brother. Our way? You sit bleeding to death and still cling to this foolish dogma. And for what? Our creed could not protect Alamut. And neither could I. Nor I. But our beliefs are why you still draw breath. And are why you must save any of us who may yet live. On that we can agree. You have my word. Allah, Basim. There is nothing left to say, brother. Go! Save who you can. Oh my goodness, we're home. Steady. Wait, so Alamut was Masyaf? The, the Masyaf that well. I thought? All is well. Your master left you in my care. Our temple. Whatever lies beneath, I must see it for myself. No matter the cost. Yo! All this blood and death. Is this what Kabiha meant by preparing the way? Nihal, please be safe. Wherever you are. I like this new outfit. I love this music, man. The classic Assassin's Creed music. Ezio's family. Oh boy. No way! What? Some of my clan still live. Mentor Rayhan among them. Mentor Rayhan. Oh my goodness. They're all dying right now, though. Like, what the heck? What am I to do here? Oh, heck no. Hold on. Can I? There we go. Get him! 
Get this mongrel off me! Get up, brother. Thank you. You're welcome. We're not all dead yet. See him. Where you going, huh? Got your toes. That's for my brothers. Oh, this is going to be fun. Oh my god, I, I literally almost screwed that up. Boom, boom. Initiate! Ugh. See ya! Over here. Gotcha! Come on, bring it! Oh. No better. Nice try. Come on, go, 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 go. What's up, guys? Get off my brothers. Screw this. What's up, Rector? Can't do anything. There we go. Oh, my God. Uh oh. Yeah. Ah. Come on. That's all I'm saying. Come on. Person. What? Person. How? I thought you were in Baghdad. Where are the others? Roshan. I came alone for the same reason these men did. I know the truth, mentor, about the temple and what it shelters. Our enemies told me as much. They urged me to seek it, because only I could. You? Thus the order used the Tahrids to decimate Alamut, because you... You are their key. To what? What are you protecting that is worth all this bloodshed? Ancient ground. For generations, it has been our duty to watch over it. Defend it from the Order, who seek to exploit its secrets. The temple houses its entrance, but Basim, even though it is forbidden, I have searched. There is no means to access it. Then I will find a way myself. You must not. It is what the Order wants, don't you see? If what we protect should fall into the wrong hands... It will fall into mine. Look around you, at what the Order is prepared to unleash upon us. If I can gain the knowledge they seek, it can be what finally gives us an edge in this endless war. This is the way forward. For the Hidden Ones. You tell him, Basim. You tell him. Let's do this. Man, I can't wait to see how this ends. You already know Roshan is going to be the final fight of this game. I just have a I just have that feeling. The temple. Let us finish this. Nothing and no one shall get in my way. Not now, not when I am this close. Moment of truth. <laughs> of course it will they're take in here more too. More than you to stop me. More of them ahead. Suffice to say, I am on the right path. Yeah, we got a couple of them. Here we go. Yeah, 
Well, they're in the temple trying to find it. We should here. Our orders were to secure the temple. Easy, easy, easy. Are you serious right now? Alright, whatever. Oh, I can't do the focus. Why can't I do the focus? What? Oh. That's annoying. Ooh, let's go. Okay. Back off. Yeah, I'd like to see you try, buddy. Oh, what? I swear I chained assassinate that. Now to see if I can achieve what these intruders could not. And of what course it's right here. Is this? Wait. I knew it. I warned it. you what would happen. Last chance. Very well. I knew it. I freaking so it knew has it. has come to this. Killing each other. Is this your idea of a brotherhood? The brotherhood is unified. There is no place for those who would set themselves above it. Is that what you think I am doing? Really? Wake up, Basim. Watch the orders pass. The very people you swore to fight against. You're fulfilling their mission. Endangering the very thing you swore to defend. Free will. And where is mine? How can I champion what? something denied to me? Bruh. Your creed is flawed. There we go. Really? This is for you. Take out the shoulder. Oh, take out the shoulder. Say what? I, I, I mean, I'm trying to take out the shoulder. Shoulder. There we go. Whew. Last chance. Yo, this music though. Dang, that did a lot of damage. Nice try. Come on. Ooh, nice try. I trusted you. It's over. Ooh. Ooh, baby. The student beats the teacher. Yield. Leave her. Come. I never wanted this. But I need to know. I do not want to lose you. To what you may find in there. You do not have to look to the past. To know who you are. Who you can be. You can choose, Basim. Put your faith in me. I tried. And in the end, you thought it best to control me. No different than our enemies. Basim, a 
Over here. I know what this is. The key. What was that? The heck was that in the background? She will follow. No, she cannot. You saw it yourself. Whatever lies within carries grave importance for the hidden ones, for the order of the ancients. For me, what have we walked into? Where has my path brought us? You do not want to know why anyone was brought to this place. Whoa. Are my eyes deceiving me? Are you seeing this? Nihal? I am. I am here. Wherever we are, it was built long ago. To serve what purpose, I do not know. I do. How? I... I do not know. Nihal, you are worrying me. Nihal, please don't betray me. Nihal, look in here. Fake? I am a part of the reality. I will walk behind every step of the way. <laughs>
yourself! Oh my... You dare to hide from me now? After all you have put me through! Where are you? You're fighting the Jenny? The Jenny's the final boss? Oh my gosh. That is crazy. So Niha was fake. The figure from these visions. They are one and the same. Is this what I have been seeing? The memories of a life long ago. Are they mine? Is that why the Jinni feels so real? My tormentor. The source of all that ails me. If this is so, then I must face you. No. Why am wow. I seeing this? What is going on? This is so crazy. As I move through it, I see nothing but the memories that stir my soul. In these moments of adversity is when I felt the Jinni nearest. An unrelenting fear, paralyzing me in my weakest state. Are we going through all the Order of the Ancients? I never understood what it was born of, or why it haunted me so. But I am beginning to remember. I am in a cold cell, begging for it all to stop. Yeah, it's going through all the Order of the Ancients. Oh, shoot. Who I once was may seek retribution. But if I am to move beyond this pain, then what I want is peace. It is time to put an end to this. Let's do it then. Oh my goodness. Wow. The cell. My cell. I am nearly there. <laughs> this I'm is so back. sick. Doing a leap of faith, aren't we? Here we go. I know you now. I see you for what you are a crippling memory from a past life. That is where you will remain. It is over. No, Basim. It is only the beginning. For us. For what lies ahead. A deeper understanding of the world we left behind. And our place in it. 
All my life, I wrestled with who I was. Who I was meant to be. And there you were. All this time. The side of me I resisted. A reflection of who we once were. And who we shall be once more. So much that awaits us. A new world. Let me show you. I will never see you again, will I? Will I be alone? You are never alone. It is done. You made your choice. Now I make mine. Wadaan Roshan bin Ahad. It was an honor. Come, Barthen. We have much to discuss. <laughs> that we do, Mentor. So sick, man. Wow. Prison, the torture I suffered here, it festered for years. In darkness and dreams, masked as a jinni, to haunt me and hollow me until it consumed my waking life. But I have faced my past, my pain, embraced it. I shed my skin once, in another time, another place. But I am whole again. 
I remember. And as for those who thought to bind me, should any of them still walk the earth? I so look forward to our reunion. But until that day, a new world awaits. Oh my goodness. In memory of Russell Lee's. Oh, rest in peace. Wow. What an incredible game. Honestly. So freaking incredible. Definitely, hands down, my favorite Assassin's Creed game by far. And even though it was short, I mean, it sucks that it was short and everything, but my goodness, man, it was still freaking awesome to just see everything and and just to see like how it all played out in the end with Roshan and, and all of that. Man, so good, man, so good, but... For what this game was, it was so much freaking fun, and you know, I'm really glad that uh, Ubisoft did make a, an Assassin's Creed game that, you know, basically went back to its roots, because, you know, this definitely was very enjoyable, and not only was it enjoyable, but it was also very, like, intriguing with the story, and that's what I was worried about the most, I'm like, alright, so where's the story gonna go? And sure enough, it goes into Basim's life and all that, but little did we know, he was just haunted this entire game. He was haunted by his his dreams, and Nihal was just imaginary and everything, which is just so crazy to me. I did not expect that at all. So the fact that, you know, it did turn out to be that way is just kind of crazy to me. But... Overall, the game play was so sick. I think it's definitely the best gameplay we've had since, well, I mean, the old Assassin's Creed. <laughs> and that's saying a lot, man. Obviously, Valhalla was all right, but this really took the cake for me as a game. And it was so much fun from the combat to a brand new city and the atmosphere, like, of Baghdad it definitely reminded me of the very first Assassin's Creed just being there especially when we got to do that little color palette thing too I love that they added that into the game that is so freaking sick and they they did a bang-up job on that and along with like the classic tools too you know with just like the the blow darts and the smoke bombs Obviously, I didn't do the trap or um, the bomb or whatever it was uh, because I, I didn't really feel the need that it was, like, useful at all. But this is exactly what I wanted right here. And I really hope, like, they continue making, you know, this classic feel to Assassin's Creed because this is literally what is what made Assassin's Creed, in my opinion. It was just so well done. So well done. I loved the story, I loved the different, like, character development that you could uh, be with everybody else, and obviously, oh look at that, I hope you enjoyed following Basim on his journey from street thief to apprentice master assassin in 9th century Baghdad. That's awesome. Long live the creed. Let's go, baby. <laughs> That's so sick. Man, it's so... It sucks that it's, like, over and everything. It really does. I really wanted to, like, keep going with it. Uh, just because, like, it's a fresh new Assassin's Creed game. And you, you just already know how I feel about that. Obviously, if you've been on the channel with me for such a long time. But I'm curious what you guys thought of the game down below as well. I'm, I'm obviously going to be looking in the comments of what you guys thought. But... I think everything was just absolutely amazing. I wish it wasn't short, like as short anyways. I wish it was like at least a couple more hours long if they could have stretched it. But other than that, they did a bang up job. I, you know, I was surprised like when we we're going in the temple, I thought we were going to see the Apple of Eden, but no, we didn't. <laughs> but we did see like a, I don't know if it was like a key 
of eating or whatever that we had to use to like open like whatever it was that it was but um man it sucks that and and it also sucks that there was no present day story but i just now realized like uh masyaf was alamut pretty much like i mean that's pretty much what it looked like anyways it really did look like um where altair was you know trained in the ways of an assassin and all that and uh masyaf is where it all started man and I, I'm I'm very happy that they like brought that back and all that. It, it just brings back so much nostalgia. And you know, it would be really, really cool if they remade the first game, you know? Heck, even the whole Ezio trilogy. If they remade the whole Ezio trilogy, that would be so freaking sick. But you already know where they're headed next, everyone. We're finally getting an Assassin's Creed game in Feudal Japan next, and I can't wait to see what comes of it. It's probably going to be my favorite game of all time, guaranteed. It, it depends on like how, how it goes and everything, unless Ghost of Tsushima 2 will take the cake for me as well. I mean, it's really close between those two, because obviously we've been wanting an Assassin's Creed game in Feudal Japan for years upon years. And they're finally gonna be making it up next. But I heard they're actually gonna be bringing back the RPG aspect thing to it, which kind of sucks because, you know, if they went with, you know, the regular classic routes, like the classic stealth routes and classic combats with automatic combat, like automatic combat and, uh, you know, combos and stuff like that and finishers, that would work so well in feudal Japan Assassin's Creed than an RPG aspect where it has hit points and everything. But, oh man, I really hope they go through with it. I hope they change their mind and not make feudal Japan RPG and just stick to the roots, man. Like, you, you came back to the roots for a reason, guys. So, and you already know people absolutely loved it. Granted, the reviews were okay, that it didn't seem like people really um, enjoyed it as much, but I, I personally did. I don't really, screw the reviews. I don't care about those reviews at all. I care about my personal opinion, and I also care about just the way and the direction of where this goes in Assassin's Creed. And obviously, yes, this is the longest review that I'm ever gonna make like, because obviously Assassin's Creed, I'm a fanatic of the series, so obviously I'm going to be talking about it a lot longer than I do other games out there. Because, man, Assassin's Creed is my bread and butter, man. I love it so, so much. I've always loved the series. Can't wait to see where this goes in feudal Japan. And hopefully, you know, they bring the present day story in it and everything with, you know, Loki on Earth now. and. I, I guess it's Loki, right? It's like Loki on Earth, like re, like reunited with uh, Sean and Rebecca and everything. Well, not reunited, but like they're now. He's now with Sean and Rebecca, so I don't really know how that's gonna go, which is gonna be crazy to me. I, I honestly, man, I'm still shocked that there was no present day story in this because obviously Loki looks just like uh, Basim. So it would have totally made sense if there was just a little bit of present day story, which is also another Debbie Downer on that. But other than that, that's pretty much all the negatives of the game. But everything else, very positive. I love that they took the kind of like unity aspect of parkour and input it into Mirage because the parkour was actually awesome in this. So freaking awesome. And I can't wait to actually uh, play this more off screen. And it, it really did give me a Unity type feel to it. So if anything, it reminded me of the original, the Ezio trilogy, and Unity, because they just didn't put the best Assassin's Creed games known to man um, of all time <laughs> into Mirage. And I think that's where their direction should go like take all the best things take all the roots that work and put it into feudal japan assassin's creed next that is just 
that would just be amazing. I think everyone would have such an amazing time and a great experience. Because obviously we don't like the, the RPG aspect to it. I love the old roots. And that is why this is probably one of my favorite Assassin's Creed games. Regardless of how short it is. Since the Ezio, the Ezio trilogy. So that is definitely my take on everything. But overall little things here and there like um the concept art the level design the music oh my gosh i love the original theme of assassin's creed mirage like i i play it in my car and i'm just like oh this is so good the drop on it is insane give them a raise man give them a raise whoever made that like was a part of that the music design was so incredible man absolutely incredible the whole Baghdad, Baghdad experience, and the Round City, and Alamut, uh, aka Masyaf, of what it looks like, and um, of course, uh, Anbar, and everything. Just really awesome, really well done. Very cinematic, too. I did really love the cinematics uh, that, you know, I haven't really seen in an Assassin's Creed game for a long time long time you see them like in the old assassin's creed trailers those are like cinematics but i love that they added cinematics in this one like you could tell from the difference of the graphics and everything and granted i didn't play it on um like the smooth mode i i played it on res resolution mode instead of like quality mode yeah instead of uh performance mode because it was just so much better man it was is better in every single way obviously it's not as smooth but it's still more realistic and that's more of like my approach that i go to when it comes to games so i'm glad they can you know do stuff like that so good man so freaking good but uh thank you thank you assassin's creed team thank you ubisoft for hooking me up with this game early and like a day early and thank you for the collector's editions as well I uh, really appreciate that. That's awesome. And this statue is so sick, man. I actually uh, have a statue picture of it on my Twitter if you guys want to see the statue and everything. And, and really the whole collector's edition. So there you go. But either way, guys, this was awesome. I can't wait to see more of like what this game has in store. Like the series, anyways. Because I'm ready, man. I'm ready for Feudal Japan next. It's gonna be so freaking good. And, oh man. I am ready. I am so ready. So bring it on. Bring it freaking on. <laughs> oh, also, I forgot to mention, of course, like the actors and actresses and stuff like that. Bang up job. That was really well done. Um, the only thing I really... Another thing really I don't like... It just seems weird to me, it's just the face, like the facial like expressions and you know, the wording on the mouth and all of that. Like it kind of just goes off. I know they want to keep using the same engine as like what they've been using with the last couple Assassin's Creed's, but at least fix like the wording of the mouth and everything. Like the mouthing and the facial expressions need to be just a little bit more like realistic and smooth otherwise they just kind of just look like robots you know and i don't know it, it just seems a bit off to me it, it reminds me of like uh you know obviously when we first got into those facial expressions was odyssey i believe yeah it was odyssey and then valhalla and then this and they they stuck with it since odyssey so I, I really think they should just, you know, go a different direction on that as well. Like, heck, even use Unreal Engine 5 or something. Do whatever it takes. Obviously, I'm not like a developer or anything, but shout out to the developers for, you know, making this at least and making it possible. And I, I mean, I love how it went. I even love like how it went like gold and everything. It's like, yep, we're done. <laughs> but... Obviously, there was still those issues that I mentioned and everything, but other than that, the game was really well done, and I had a blast with it, and I can't wait to play more of it, like, off-screen and everything. It's... Oh, man. 
It's gonna be so much fun. And obviously, I want to go to that cave and see, like, you know, those last two weapons and everything, but I don't think that's enough, like, for a video. So, I guess this truly will be the final part of Assassin's Creed Mirage, but you already know I'm gonna be playing it off screen a lot because brand new fresh experience, absolutely loved it, and by far one of my favorite Assassin's Creed games known to boot, so <laughs> I loved it, man. But yeah, again, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. I'll definitely be reading your comments and uh, would love to see your take on this game, what you thought down below. The gadgets are really fun too, and all the different bureaus definitely remind me of the original Assassin's Creed because, you know, the grass rooftop and all that definitely reminded me of that. So freaking good. Also love that there was costumes in this and dyes, which was also like, you know, a thing in the Ezio trilogy. And I loved the dyes, man. The dyes were so cool. Granted, I only used like a couple because I didn't find as many, but obviously I could have unlocked more dyes because I collected so many of those pages to actually unlock the dyes. But, you know, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. So we'll just forget it but let's see what happens after this i'm sure it's gonna say game completed oh look at that oh my goodness wow it's so quiet there we go shukran congratulations on completing assassin's creed mirage you've been returned to baghdad with all your gear and equipment from before the final chapter of Basim's journey in alamut really Okay. Oh, I totally remembered, like, uh, the contracts and everything. If you guys wanna... If you guys want extra videos, I guess I'll just leave it up to you guys. Hamam, okay. Interesting. But yeah, if you guys want extra videos and everything, let me know. And I will definitely deliver. But until then, we're gonna move on to the next series, which I am super stoked about, by the way. And if you can guess what it is, it's gonna be Spider-Man 2. Super excited for whenever I get my hands on that. I mean, if I have to buy it, I will if I don't get the hookup, but I can't wait to play that game. That's gonna be a must play. And I'm sure it's gonna be everyone's game of the year out there, like for sure, because I mean, Spider-Man 2018 and Miles Morales, it was really well done, so. But either way, I've been chatting for so long, so if you made it to the very end, a special thank you to everyone who has stuck with me in the end and everything. It really and truly means a lot to me. And I hope that, you know, I really hope that the next couple of series and everything will go in and all that because, you know, I always have hopes that you guys come through with that support always always and forever and i want to personally thank you for you know this huge journey that i've been on and it's just 10 years man 10 years absolutely crazy to me and i love it a lot like what is this one initiate uh, alamut outfit it looks like the original outfit and then we got this one desert traveler costume Oh, by the way, these three are actually um, ones you have to buy. So, yeah. <laughs> so there's that. But we got the Desert Traveler costume. That's pretty cool. Man, that reminds me of Prince of Persia a lot. Which also was another thing that uh, kind of reminded me of everything was uh, Prince of Persia. So, another really well done game. Like a classic before Assassin's Creed, actually, I believe. So, yeah, it was it was pretty good. You know what? I'm actually gonna go back and use all these shards just to see like these these weapons and everything. So we ain't done yet. Let's just go ahead and unlock the last two gates, I believe. I think it's two more. Anyways, I I could be wrong, obviously, but we'll see. But I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and do it because why not? Because obviously I'm gonna I was gonna do it off screen, but eh, why not? Let's just keep uh, 
Let's keep the show, this ball rolling. Just unlock the rest of these things, huh? Let's do it. We're gonna dive under here one last time. We'll take a good look at um, these weapons as well. So I can just showcase them off and then that will be the end of the Assassin's Creed Mirage series. It's a really short series, by the way. I think uh, when I, after I edit this or whatever, it's going to be like 12 parts. So... Or I may not even edit it. Who knows? But I believe it's going to be a 12-part series. Most likely. Which is <laughs> probably the shortest Assassin's Creed game we've ever had. Ever. Because I, I even believe the Ezio Trilogies was longer than that. Okay, yeah, there's one last gate. Here we go. It was just three. Case closed, baby. It's the sword. Shem, Sheer, Zara. I, I mean, I can't even... <laughs> I can't even pronounce that. But let's take a good look at it. Obviously, I went with this one for so long. The Sand Sword was just absolutely incredible. 63 damage, too. I mean, that can't be beat, obviously. But there we go. And what this does is maximum health is lowered by 50%, but damage is increased by 50%. That's crazy. Honestly, I should have got that a long time ago. What is wrong with me? I should have did that for, like, the final fight and everything. But whatever. It is what it is. But let me go ahead and go back to... The Round City, which obviously, you know, is like right here. Um, but yeah, we see all of these like contracts right here. But either way, that is going to be it for the series, everyone. So with that being said, thank you so much for watching. You guys are the best and only Assassination family on YouTube going big and growing strong. I love you all. And if you're new, be sure to subscribe to the Assassination Family today. I'd be honored to have you on this 2023 journey with me. And get ready for Spider-Man, everyone. It's going to be a crazy series. So can't wait for it. My goodness. It is going to go absolutely in. But let's go with this classic. Just a nice little send-off, you know? With that being said, I love you all. And as always... I will see all of you guys and girls in the next series. Assassin4259, out.